working out, you might be like, this is small, but this is actually what you want. You know, the earliest you start like this, I mean, the more you like, you know, the fastest you know, like it, you need 30 minutes in the first place. You know, you just don't need to go in there and, you know, go too hard and then you feel like it's too much. You don't, you don't want to go back again. And then... Happy New Year, guys. I hope the year started very well for you guys and everything is following along as planned. I know it's maybe the first time for some of you guys to land, it on, to land here on the channel. For some of you guys that have been here already, you're welcome back here. For the newbies, welcome on the channel. Here we talk about everything that comes in relation with sport, fitness and everything. So what I have for you guys today is going to be like couple of tips you know I know a new year always comes along with a lot of resolution so many people actually take resolution that they might feel like oh, I'm ready to achieve of this I'm willing to achieve this and that and most of the times as far as I can tell most people really want to start being more active you know starting a new business starting working out being more healthy so that's actually where I'm gonna be taking part today I want to give you guys a couple of tips if you are really thinking like working out it's gonna be something that you really want to bring into your life you know they make make it like trying to make it like a habit a lifestyle or whatever so you are actually welcome because I will try to talk to you guys about it so that you know you don't really go to the gym and then you know you don't feel like you can you get like kind of lost with this you know you know this is a bit difficult when you really want to start working out you really start being you really want to start being healthy knowing what to eat you know there's so many information so you feel like sometimes it's a bit difficult so i'm gonna give you a couple of tips here so i'll start with telling you that if you actually thought that it was the right time for you to start being healthy having more healthy habits sleeping early eating right training or doing something that makes your mind more healthy like congratulations already you know congratulations just from having the idea really congratulations what I want to tell you though is that you know thinking about this is way different than actually implementing it you know? so as far as thinking about this is a very good thing so the one thing I really want you to think is that along the way the thing is going to be very very difficult you might have hurdles you know you might have ups and downs but always along the way one thing you have to keep in mind is the reason why you actually thought about this in the first place you understand so when you start with everything you have to go and start learning what you really want to do from uh, what exactly you are waiting you are expecting from this journey you know this one tips actually so you have to be very clear about what you want this journey to be like you know because if you have a clear idea of whatever you really want to achieve of course you can actually think about how you can get there you understand so really think about how what exactly you want to achieve with this journey you know you can it can be like you don't really want to work out it can be like you just don't really want to lift weight means like you know, you know it can be like you just really want to clean up a little bit of the overweight you got during this time you know eating a lot or you know maybe get past the old habit that you had that wasn't you wouldn't like it you were not liking anymore and then you really wanted to change them so for you you really have to be able to identify the real project you know the real goal behind all this adventure you understand and from there you'll be able to actually find the tools to help you getting to the result second of all once that you have idea about what you really want to do think about how this is going to make your life better because we are here for the better we are not coming here to sink to be sinking down you know what i'm saying so think about how what positive impact this is going to have in your life because you just don't really want to budge in because you saw one of your best friend doing it you know or you because you saw one of your, one of your neighbor doing it you have to think about the impact this is going to bring on your life you know what i'm saying think about it and on the tough days i want you to really think that to i want you to really hold on to this thought you know like when you think about the positive impact that it's going to have on your life when it's hard think about it 
when it's nice, think about it. When you go to work, think about it. When you do whatever you have to do, think about it, you know? Third tips I want to give you guys, like, the best advice I can ever give you is look for a coach, look for a trainer. I mean, it can be an online, an online trainer, you know, you can come to my channel to actually seek for information. You can hit me on, the Inst on my Instagram. Over there, I'll, be, I'll make sure I'm, I deliver, you know, as much as I can. I like sharing. So go right there, you know, drop any question you want, and, you, you know, I'll make sure that I actually answer the way I know. You understand? But what I want you to do is, like, it's better to actually have a physical, a physical, a physical trainer like a one that you can actually see you can talk to he can see exactly what you look like what you want you know you can talk to him in details in details when it comes to what you really want to achieve you know before you start and when you get a trainer be very very clear with him about what exactly you want if you can you know if you can't afford a trainer talk to someone that's more experienced than you that's what i'm telling you you know you have youtube now you have big channels that you can actually go through and then you can get information, you know, so that it gets you to start like without risk, you understand, without, why, by, why minimizing the risk, I mean. So get yourself a trainer, talk to him exactly about what you want, what you want to achieve, what you are willing to do and what you are willing not to, you know. I mean, those people are really trained, they know what, how to talk to you, to identify exactly the journey you want to fit into. So talk to a trainer. Make sure everything is arranged before you start. If you really don't want to work with a trainer, maybe you have difficulties following orders, maybe you have like financial issues, you can't really afford a trainer, come. You have YouTube, you have the whole internet, you have Instagram, don't just go there for socializing. You can ask questions. Many people are right there, including myself, to give you answers to the questions. Now that you have a trainer, let's go to the fourth tip. Now that you have a trainer, like you have in your mind like an idea maybe you're gonna have a trainer maybe you are not going to and then maybe you actually you are ready to go you know you are ready to go down so now what i want you to do is like think exactly about this thing schedule three like when i said three i said three schedule three schedule three different workout for the first week you're starting with you're starting to work out, you understand? So let's say you're starting Monday. Schedule three workouts starting from Monday. So you can work Monday, you can skip Tuesday, you can go back on Wednesday, and then you can skip again Thursday, and on Friday you are back at, back at it. So, and what I want you to do is like this training session, I want you to schedule them for not more than 30 minutes each. You understand? That will be a total amount, a total working hours of a total of one and a half hours in the first week working out you might be like this is small but this is actually what you want you know the earliest you start like this i mean the more you like you know the fastest you know like it, you need 30 minutes in the first place you know you just don't need to go in there and you know go too hard and then you feel like it's too much you don't want, you don't want to go back again and then the reason why i'm asking you to actually split it up like having one day on one day off is so that you can actually enjoy also the days when you know you are not doing anything with the gym and all everything or something like that so your body gets to recharge back the batteries so that you can go back there again on Thursday on, on, on Wednesday you understand do it like that and then from the second week if you feel like it's going good keep doing the same thing at least for a month like at least for a month make sure you stick to that program at least for a month and after a month if you feel like yeah you feel like you can do some more add another extra 30 minutes you know and then from there every month if you feel like more you add you feel like you need you really need some more and you or you have more times so or you feel like you want to progress you know you need progression okay you can you can add another extra one 30 minutes for each week you know and then you see like up to the time that you can be like you have each session maybe five six times in a week two two hours that's enough you understand from there you know you'll be a little bit advanced by the time and then you know what to adjust or not you understand so now tip you're already at the gym right now you're already at the gym you are you know or whatever you are going for exercising or doing whatever make sure you look on your yourself you are there for yourself you are there to improve whatever was lacking was lacking 
transform you know your daily lifestyle so you are there for yourself you are there with yourself you are there for yourself so don't look at anybody in the gym don't look at anybody it can be in the gym it can be in the swimming pool it can be whatever you are a beginner you stick to what you can do maybe as a beginner you might be very advanced that some other people that were in there you know you might be able to do certain things but you don't want to take the same risk as they do because their body is very used to it already I mean they have a bit more experience than you and you certainly don't want to stop with this journey before it started so go there in the beginning make sure you master the beginning moves like the beginners move make sure you master this before you go to something advanced if your trainer tells you do this and that don't try to challenge the guy and show him that you can do more follow what he's going to tell you yeah follow what he's going to tell you this is going to be very very helpful for you in the long run you know if you go too hard the first day you burn up everything and then the second day you don't want to come on in you, you don't want to come in because trust me you have soreness you understand even on a diet make sure you don't go too strict in the beginning if you were having like three four cheat days like eating crabs reduce them you know scale them down slowly until you reach the stage where you can live without crabs you understand you can live without junk food that's how you do correct everything slowly and get to enjoy the process that's how you can do it you understand this one I'm gonna I'm gonna leave it here for now and then make sure like you drop me a comment if you really feel like you want me to talk about this again you know give you more tips so that you can actually start with this journey and enjoy it I'm available guys I will make sure like in the next days I will make sure I upload some videos about what type of food you can be eating we're gonna talk a little bit more about you know how to actually calculate what you are what you need like as in the daily or you know what calories intakes you really need for your body you know giving you tips to learn how to calculate a little bit approximately what you put into the system you know how to evaluate the proper workout how to you know not overtrain and all these little things we're going to talk about this on the channel as well as some workout video you know maybe from home from the gym i hope the gyms are open very soon so that we can actually do that so anyway guys if you are new on the channel you know what to do make sure you share this with any of your friends that you know took the resolution that he will definitely start working out in 2021 because this is going to be our year share it to him make sure you motivate him with whatever our videos you know subscribe to the channel because we'll bring him more videos very soon drop a comment down if you really need us to come with something else give a like to the video guys and you know goodbye wish you all the best for this year